We're gathered here in this beautiful setting in front of witnesses and family, and we're here to celebrate this very beautiful day for these two lovely people. When I think of Emily, the first words that come to my mind are light, soul, kind, beauty, hustle, goofy, fun, creative, growth, adventure, nature, healer, love, and family. Look at you. Beautiful, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I truly believe that this was a match made in heaven. How proud your parents would be of you today. And I know they're here with us, and I know that they wouldn't have wished for you to be in any other family than with Lockie. I knew there was something uniquely special and extraordinary about you from our very first conversation. And we both knew leaving our first date that we had finally found the one. I always dreamed my future children would have a dad as special as my dad was. I got my wish. You're the man of my dreams. I promise to love you completely, to honor and respect you, and to take care of you in all circumstances. I promise to cherish our love and never take you for granted. I promise to expand with you on our lifelong journey as lovers and parents. I promise to keep our home a sacred space where love and laughter come first. I promise to walk hand in hand by your side through all the amazing years, loving you, choosing you for all my days to come. When I would ask people, how do you know you've met the right one? It would annoy me when they would say, when you know, you know. But I still remember on our first date, it finally made sense and right away I knew. And I can't believe we're now standing here four and a half years later, getting married and about to have our third donk. You have the perfect balance of being so generous and sweet, but also not a pushover. And it's amazing to see those same qualities in Micaiah. If I had only one word to describe you, that word would be integrity. I vow to be your best protector and will always keep you safe as you are my eternal love. Now, by the authority vested in me by the province of British Columbia, you are duly married. You may kiss your bride. And now may I introduce to you for the very first time Dr. and Mrs. Chambers. I can't think of a greater couple and a greater party. It's a real tribute to Emily and Lockie and their, and their lovely marriage. So thank you, raise a toast to the married couple. Spending time with Lockie and Emily, it quickly becomes apparent how much love they have for each other and their kids. The smiles on Micaiah and Morrison's faces say it all. They are living a truly beautiful life. So cheers to my new sister-in-law, brother, niece, and nephew. Much love and looking forward to living the best possible life with you. <laughs>